Hi friends, welcome to Caesar tutorial. Now in this Caesar tutorial, I am telling that uh, one of the important concept for how to use that parameter. Uh, already I am telling you. In this video, I am telling you as a, uh, encryption method. But I will all that why means if you know the parameter, after I will tell means it will be uh, understood clearly. So that purpose I am telling here parameter concept, and then after I will tell to you encryption method. Okay, now I am going to tell here uh, parameter method. Okay, uh, so uh, see already I am using here data entry project so that was I'm going to select here data data entry project so just select this data entry and then I'm creating here uh, procedure name okay so first of all I want to create um, procedure see like this I want to declare means that is also possible and then also I'm going to um, procedure I go to practice so example and select this one and then execute here and click OK means it will be executed. Okay, so like this, it will be executed. And then also, you can go to get that procedure uh, procedure uh, code means just to go to edit in new Windows means it will automatically it will be get. Okay, so this time copy this here. So this is for procedure just to copy and then I go to close it and then here ok just erase it and then control B so like this ok now execute means it's automatically already created so the purpose like this just I'm given here alter means like this means it will be executed okay it will be executed okay so if you want to see that uh, record means just to go to select example now I go to execute so it automatically it will be record all the record we can get okay so here how do you use that parameter in this uh, place okay so just I want to uh, create a uh, parameter for uh, to this table so just I'm going to create uh, some store post there, other some other store post here. Okay, so just I'm going to click here, create procedure, create procedure here, declare parameter. Okay, parameter. Uh, the procedure name as a parameter I'm declared here. And then I want to create here at symbol. When you are using at symbol, that is a parameter. After you declare means that is parameter. And declare here, uh, here gender. Okay, see why I declare the gender means in this place. Uh, see, I have the status unmarried status, married unmarried. So that uh, this parameter and passing means the time you can get that. Uh, all records a married person and unmarried person by using the, this one parameter the status parameter and the gender parameter I am using here ok so just time go to uh, declare uh, parameter ok uh, see what one, one which here I want to connect charger without charger away. So just I want to declare the here parameter. So I go to clear create status status and then where that in where that I want to why I am declare the where that means you should declare that you should declare that uh, data type that purpose only you can create a parameter ok and we are there that uh, can I declare here just uh, that like that and then in comma now I am going to declare another one parameter that is gender gender column 
no and go to the and where care this one also that is or anything 15 also you can give 15 enough i think and then i am going to declare as as behind and then end now i declare the year uh, query for get that uh, record okay so that purpose i am going to declare here select select all from select all from table which table register table so register i am going to declare register table so register table of uh, register table where with respect to where condition where condition declare here uh, we go to status status in the status status i am declared here um, shift at the parameter and name i am passing here status okay at parameter name i am passing here and then and another one gender gender in this gender also i am passing equal shift at the parameter name I want to pass here gender okay so like this so now I go to execute this so successfully I created so just I go to refresh this stop user so that parameter stop user I got here okay now this stop user of the parameter uh, I want to see here the result so here how to see the parameter result just time go to select and then execute means we can't get the record ok so how to get record means see just to copy this and then go to declare in top position here control V we want to pause that value of the parameter ok so just I go to see n worker means uh, that is one of the uh, text ok so that is one of the text so that purpose I am using here single code double single code ok comma and then also gender also uh, n worker so that is also text so that purpose I am declare here uh, double quotation sorry single quotation here I am go to declare see uh, this is status is unmarried ok so just I am copy this control C and then declare here control V ok unmarried status see first of all I am declare status so the purpose I am declare st uh, status or detail ok status details so status details unmarried so the purpose I am declare and then after mail ok so gender is in mail so just to copy this and then go to declare sign is gender so the purpose I am declared here sign parameter so the purpose I am declared like this now I am shift oh this one I am selected now I will execute means I got result see unmarried person see all are unmarried person and then also all are male person ok ok like this you can get suppose I go to change here female female ok now I am going to select all now I am going to execute so female person unmarried person only one person ok suppose I am going to select this female person married person ok female person married person so if I want know about this person so select this means so married person and then female two person ok suppose I go to select male person married person means just to go to select and then execute means so married person male 
this three person okay like this we can get so uh, see like this we, we can get the record by using this parameter okay suppose I go to change the record okay see I go to change uh, here control X here and declare mail like this and then here declare unmarried married so this mail is the gender but I am passing see this is first place and then this is second place okay mail is here first place but I am declaring second place parameter okay gender is a male okay so gender male or female checking parameter so the purpose see status is first person first place but I am declared the status in second place but this is not correct way see I am going to run this it will it will be not uh, show the record okay it will be not show the record so this is not uh, correct okay see if you want to uh, check uh, some other means just and go to give here comma and then go to I am declare ID shift at I am declare ID parameter and give int value okay int okay integer now I am change to year ID and then here declare shift at ID okay control s sorry just I want to execute see this one I am just go to uh, areas ok now I go to here and declare nware care of text and then here also nware care of text I am declare and then here nware care but I am declare here integer ok now I am going to execute this one this is incorrect so the purpose showing error ok so here I go to declare gender male and then also here go to declare value of id ok so just I go to 1 I execute here execute in one id male is not there so just I go to declare female like this and then go to execute means it will be shown some error occur ok why means I want to select this one all this is select and then ok so that one also not having here ok suppose see this is first of all and declare gender nware care detail second was uh, id integer value so nware care first of all and then second one uh, id integer value here I am given also nware care and then second id ok the int value suppose I have changed this ok just I am select this all control x and then now I have given control b see now I change that here in here I want to I, sh I have to declare I should have to declare this one integer value before I want to uh, declare that nware can value but I change here ok so this is not also incorrect Oh sorry correct method this is incorrect method so showing some uh, details also error ok so how to uh, correct this one uh, if I go to here I pausing um, shift hat gender gender and gender equal I am declare female and and then comma here um, shift add status Status equal unmarried. 
see spell right or wrong and married okay now I go to execute this one means so just I want to copy this parameter and then I want to declare here control V and then he called here sorry here also I want to call that uh, n where care that value I declared here unmarried person and then female person only one person okay like this you can also possible okay directly you are declared that parameter id also you can declare means it will be get suppose i go to the parameter value see first of all i declare that status after i declare here uh, gender okay but i am declare here first of all gender and then after I change the status so this is correct way suppose like this i am declare means see like this and declare means this is not correct way just to see so this is female this is not a status a gender is a unmarried marriage this is not right so just and go to run this what happens see carefully so execute so none data is available so like this this is not right way so that purpose I should like this means the ID the parameter value you called here means that is possible to right way so directly you can pause that and then execute like this okay so you can get that and then also if you want to change the data I means just to go to married person and then just time go to execute means so all record we can get suppose I go to declare here female uh, change to male and then now I go to execute here so we can get record okay like this so if this is right way okay so parameter means uh, it's one of the uh, secure method for uh, passing record and then get record retrieve record everything okay so you use in your project means you can add it to EC and then repeat to also everything easy way to by using this parameter thank you friends uh, if you like this video means subscribe me and then uh, Share to you uh, if you uh, if you have any doubts, please comment to me. Thank you. Bye. Bye.